can the new iPhone replace my virtual assistant? With the iPhone 16's release, we're not just talking about a better camera or a sleek new design, which are both pretty cool, but the big takeaway is Apple making some serious moves with AI. And if you're in real estate, this can be more than just a flashy upgrade. So imagine a device that doesn't just respond to commands, but understands your needs as a realtor. So it's an assistant that's always in your pocket. Today, we're going beyond the surface level features and diving into how these advancements in Apple AI could transform the way real estate professionals work. So whether it's managing client interactions, scheduling your day, or analyzing market data on the fly, there's a ton to unpack here, so let's get right into it. So Apple's been quietly ramping up its AI game, and with the iPhone 16, it feels like they're trying to make some serious moves. We're seeing a significant upgrade in on-device machine learning and natural language processing. So what that means to the layperson, Apple is moving beyond just, hey Siri, set a reminder, to actually understanding context, intent, and more importantly, what we as users really need. And that's where things get interesting for us. In real estate, we deal with sensitive data and client information daily. Apple's on-device AI keeps that information more secure by processing it locally rather than in the cloud. This means quicker responses, better security, and ideally a more intelligent assistant that could integrate into our workflows. But the real question is, how can we put this tech to use in a way that actually makes a difference in our day-to-day -day operations? So let's start with client interactions. Right now, a lot of our communication, whether it's emails or text or follow-up calls is reactive. But imagine an AI that can help make this more proactive. For example, Apple AI could learn from your past clients' communications and start suggesting new properties that align with their specific preferences. No more generic lists. Think tailored suggestions based on what your clients have actually shown interest in. Imagine Siri being smart enough to remind you about a client's anniversary or a follow-up opportunity using insights from your calendar and email. Now, let's take it up a notch. Picture this, an AI system trained on your local real estate board's data. So instead of spending hours digging through recent sales, market trends, and valuation comps, you can upload the latest stats and the AI does the heavy lifting for you. So if you need a quick valuation on a new listing or a comparison of similar properties that sold last month, done instantly. With Apple AI's processing capabilities, these kinds of real-time calculations and insights aren't just possible, they could actually become the norm. So imagine the competitive advantage of having that kind of information at your fingertips with data-backed answers ready for your clients on the fly. And here's where it gets even more powerful. So instead of working through complex spreadsheets or hopping between multiple apps, you can get a comprehensive market analysis with a single voice command or a quick upload. It's a complete game changer, especially in a fast moving market like here in Toronto, where speed and accuracy matters. Now let's take it down a bit and talk scheduling. Uh, not as sexy as market stats, but super important. We all know how crazy our calendars can get. Apple AI could offer a more intuitive way to manage all of that. Think of it as a supercharged assistant that not only books your meetings, but also optimizes your day. So it's factoring in everything from travel time and traffic to even the weather. So less time commuting, more time doing what we do best. But let's keep it grounded. This is new territory. Apple AI is smart, but there's a difference between a great demo and real world application. The key will be how well it integrates with all the specific tools we use, like the MLS systems and CRMs and all the other real estate software we use. So we've talked about all the software, but let's actually talk about the iPhone itself. Let's talk about its hardware. The iPhone 16's new neural engine is built to handle these advanced AI capabilities better than before. So you can get faster processing, better responsiveness, and improved multitasking. All sounds great on paper, but what does that mean for us as realtors? So 
With a faster neural engine, the device can run more complex AI-driven features without any lag. So this means less time waiting for things to load and more time focusing on our clients. And with an extended battery life, we can now push those features throughout the day without being constantly tethered to a charger. And then privacy is another strong suit here. So with most of the data processing happening on the device itself, there's less worry about sensitive client information being exposed to the cloud. So it's not a complete fail safe, but it does add a certain layer of security that could be appealing. Now, will it replace the tools we already use? I mean, probably not right away, but it could make them work a whole lot better together and that's to start. But let's not get carried away. Any new tech comes with a learning curve. And while Apple's ecosystem is famously user-friendly, it doesn't mean we won't have to put in the work to integrate these tools into our workflows. There are also costs, I mean, quite high costs, and potential compatibility issues with existing software to consider. So the bottom line, it's about weighing those pros and cons. Early adopters often find the most unique ways to use and leverage the new tools, but it's not a one size fits all solution. You have to see where this fits into your overall tech strategy. So here's my takeaway. The iPhone 16, but more importantly, Apple AI, offer some intriguing possibilities for us as real estate professionals. It's not about jumping on every new feature, but understanding which tools can actually help you work smarter. So maybe it's time to explore how AI could fit into our daily routines, or maybe not, but the future is certainly worth keeping an eye on. If this deep dive gave you something to think about, hit that like button, subscribe for more tech insights tailored to real estate, and let's keep conversation going in the comments. Are you planning to test any of these new AI features, or are you gonna hold off for now and wait till the further technology to get a little bit better? Anyhow, stay tuned. We've got a new video coming up on EVs and car chargers that you definitely don't wanna miss.